This is a new project based on recycling scrounge materials and I'm really excited about. My friend Pat gave me this rooftop stowage thing uh, that he found blown off along the, uh, the road. I've had it beside the house for a couple months and I had originally felt I was going to separate the two halves and drill drainage holes uh, a couple inches from the bottom and bury them and turn them into water-wise container gardens. But I'm now m finding much more appealing the idea of turning each half into a uh, fish pond. And very likely, actually one of them, the deeper white one right here in this location, I'm reinventing my front yard from hell that was ruined by drought and a 45-foot mermaid bush that kept me out for a year and a half. And I like the idea of a pond being on the right side of the pathway that leads into what used to be a beautiful collection of roses and will be again. All I'm going to do, since the, uh, the screws that hold these uh, hinges in place are super, super rusted, I cannot get them to budge. So I'm going to simply use this hacksaw and make a cut and the two uh, arms shall just swing down and drop into place. And I'll go ahead and do a watertight test on both halves. I just noticed the uh, gray portion has these bolts and I'm wondering if that will be a source of leakage. Uh, but the white deeper portion, and you can see it's, it could allow for a quite deep shell. I'm hoping it's totally watertight because I think it can make for a very, very beautiful goldfish pond. I think it is so much fun to take scavenged materials and dream of something to use them for then even if you have a ton of money just to run out and say buy a pond shell at Home Depot. To me it's just so much more fun to work with what you have at hand uh, and plus it's a way of keeping valuable things out of landfills. I'll keep you all posted as this project uh, evolves. Bye bye.